Hello, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Vaz Food Review. Today we're looking at Bitterman's Hellfire Habanero Shrub. A shrub, in this case, is similar to bitters, it's a drink additive, unlike shrubs, which is usually made like with water and just regular alcohol and aromatic herbs. This is a shrub is made out of a vinegar and fruit distillation. It's also called drinking vinegar. So this fruit is the habanero pepper, because peppers are vinegars. This isn't something you drink on its own, so I have some blue curacao and some mango nectar because mango habanero is a pretty popular drink. Uh, so we are going to give this a nice fruity citrus flavor. Um, Bitterman's makes other shrubs and they, I think they make some bitters too. Uh, I'll have their website down below. Um, really, really cool website, really cool stuff. I actually, I tried this in a, in a mango drink at a uh, place called Lawns here in Arizona. Um, and I'm gonna do two shots, where's my shot glass, oh there it is. Uh, two shots of the blue curacao. Oh uh, yeah, I tried it at a place called Lawns and they were helpful enough. I was like, I've never heard of Hellfire. What is Hellfire? And they're like, oh, Hellfire is this drink mixture that we, we put in the drinks. I'm like, well, can, I, I'd really like to try it on its own. And they're like, oh, okay. So they brought out the bottle that I just showed you. It's gonna have a nice, blue color there, almost like a turquoise, um, and they let me try just the, the non-diluted stuff. Um, so it has a little stopper, I'll show you guys here, uh, let me move that back in so you guys can see. It's got a nice, so it has this little stopper, it is a, a dark red color, so I'm gonna just get one. And hopefully this will make a nice purple color, but I don't know if it'll be enough. And it's got this, this, this nice smoky sweetness and spice to it. And I'll, I'll do three, actually, because I like my drink spicy. It's, it's not overwhelmingly spicy. It's not like the crazy concoction we made with ghost chilies. Uh, it's a nice soothing spice. It's not going to be too overpowering. I'm just going to get a, a, a knife here, which I'll just use a... Uh, it didn't come out quite as purple as I wanted. It came out as a nice turquoise color. That's still a really pretty drink. So I'm just going to get a drink here. came out, like I said, a nice turquoise color. Um, smells like mango, and you can definitely get a hint of the spice, so I'm just going to... Ooh, so it has a nice, is it a nice spice in the back of your throat? It's not overpowering. It's almost like a cinnamon spice. I thought I probably could have done done four of those small droppers. Um, so it's not quite spicy enough for me. It's probably spicy enough for for most people. But this is good. You can't taste the alcohol at all. The mango nectar really covers it up. I'm not a big fan of mango, but the habanero mango mixture is one of my favorite flavors to do with spicy foods, especially as like a glaze or something like that. Usually with pork or chicken. And there's nothing wrong with this. After a couple sips, you can start to feel it on your tongue. If you guys like spicy stuff or just like making your own mixed drinks, I'd definitely give Bitterman's a shot. They're really cool. I'll, again, I'll have their, their uh, website down in the description down below so you guys can check them out. As always, guys, thanks for watching.